To help you get your orientation in or plan, I'll first take you on a little journey of discovery. When you start all plan, the welcome screen opens first. Here you can create new projects, open existing ones or copy them. You can access our Connect, Exchange and Bimplus platforms directly from the welcome screen and find lots of helpful links. I will show you the possibilities of Connect, Exchange and Bimplus in the other Hello All Plan videos. To help you find everything quickly, I will first show you the AllPlan user interface. At the top of the title bar you can see which AllPlan version you are using, which project is currently open and which drawing file you are actively using. On the left side of the title bar you can call up the list with all existing projects or create new ones. You can call up the building structure. Save. Edit. Open the print preview. Repeat previously used functions. Influence the display and control visibility of elements. Or customize your window arrangement. Allplan offers you the possibility to arrange your windows in the way that suits you best for the way you work. If you work with multiple monitors, you can simply drag them to another monitor and work there. Next to it you will find the options. Here you can set the background color and control graphic settings. Control how your crosshairs look and much more. In the title bar at the top right you can log into Bimplus if you want to work with Allplan Share, for example. You will find the Allplan status page. There you can check if everything is working properly. You can call up the All Plan shop and find many options that can help you if you get stuck, such as the All Plan help. Below you will see the action bar. Here you will find all functions centrally and clearly arranged. On the left you can select the role. And then you can select the appropriate functions in the tasks and task areas that are highlighted in blue. The tasks that are highlighted in grey are independent of the selected role and are always available to you. At the bottom left you will find the dialog line. No matter what you do, always pay attention to this line. After you have selected a function, it explains what you have to enter to get the desired result. In the next video you will get useful information about the palettes.